Hello and welcome to another episode of Potential Pain. But before we get onto the games, let's head over to the Tembo household. There was a keeper who saved everything and Tembo was his name. O-T-E-M-B-O-T-E-M-B-O-T-E-M-B-O and Tembo was his name. O. Good old Panda having a great season with 15 goals scored. He is the top goal scorer in League One. 0.68. I was reading that. 0.68 goals per match. Yes. It's Leighton Orient against Barrow. Our outcomes are going to change. I'm clipping it to the edge of the box. Romeo Nantanina saved by the Barrow keeper. That looked destined for the top corner. Here comes the corner kick. Severin Colombo off the line. What a great header. Sam Lewis tries to play, play it to someone on the edge of the box, but no one was reacting in time. Panda got tripped a little bit. Could go and take the free kick, but he carries on. Romeo Nantanina wants the ball played early. Can't get good connection. Barrow had the worst away record. We need this win. To the back post. Dadashev should have the angles. That's a good save by Tembo. A back heel. Stopped. Little back heel. That'll be it. Game's gone, mate. Game's gone. So the opponent to get the open up. Bruno Sosa. Quick. Ah, oh, into Amit Panda's path. We go through if that pass is on the money. Absolutely dominating here. 1-0 down on the scoreline. Recently, before the recording sessions, I've just worried about how the AI are going to steal victories from me. I want it to end, man. John Paul Sabali. There we go. That's better passing. Amit Panda in the box. We couldn't hit him. Keep it moving. John Paul Sabali. Nantanina's the one open. Just missing the pass again. Standard. Omar Dadashov. Now Jean Paul Sabali. Here we go. Romeo Nantanina. Ah! I'm just so defeated. What a header that is by Jean-Paul Zabali. Great ball. Bruno Sosa on point. Let's get Bobby Monk on. And also, I think we need a mascot to cheer me up. I can hear Noodle outside. Are you going to cheer me on? I think that's a yes. Jean-Paul Zabali into the box. It's not to Nina. Yes! 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 Noodle! I think he wants to go out again. But he's given us that look. <laughs> Has Noodle removed the curse? No. Oh, they scored straight away. Noodle, I need you back in here. Romeo Nantanina. Options for Yomba. Great ball. Great ball, Romeo. Get him back up to speed there, lad. Oh, penalty. Let's do it, Bruno Sosa. For goodness sake. This shouldn't even be a close contest. Sosa, get it out of there. Jesus. Here's Jean-Paul Sabali. Up to Bobby Monk. Control it well. Yeah. Oh, mate, this goalkeeper's cracked. I've got to push on with Severin Colombo. Should be slightly offside. Don't go in. Please don't go in. Oh. Oh. 86th minute. Barrow have basically won the game. Three added minutes. Roddy Forrest sends it wide. Sabali is offside for no reason whatsoever. Try and play a low ball into the box. And it's too close to the goalkeeper. Another misplaced pass. Jean pulls the bally. This keeper is a joke. It's done. Game's over. Full time. We've lost again. Oh, hang on. 26 yard free kick. So, so, you could apologize in the best manner by scoring that. No. No. <laughs> this keeper. He's broken, man! We had 15 shots. Higher XG. I want to see the ones on target. We had double the amount of shots on target. I uh, just cannot cope. I can't cope. Do I look like a guy who wants to play in the Papa John's trophy right now? I'm simming the match. If we lose, well, sorry, guys. Amit Panda just squeezed one in for 1-0. Good on the lads for performing well when I'm not around. At least they've got that to hold on to. I'm loving the movement. Bruno Sosa, 2-0. That should be three. 
Sabali is on side. 4-0. Henry Yomba. We have entered depression season. These lads are so much better without me. 5-0. Romeo Nantanino. When the game is even, they can cough up results like this. Well, this really was an incredible performance. And they're into the third round of the Papa John's Trophy. I mean, the first team is knackered. At home against Doncaster, just check this snow on the ground so we need a yellow ball had to change most of the team because the papa john's trophy took a lot out of the players um and they brought the white ball out i've just said let's play with the yellow one bro what if i had like color blindness or something that shocking behavior so how is the game gonna rob us today bobby monk to the wing as lozano got the speed i think he might actually have the speed cross is coming in <laughs> Oh my goodness, where was that going? We've had three handballs in 19 minutes. Our team effectively playing basketball out there. Then again, it does feel like a different sport at times. Another short corner. Should have been intercepted. Of course, they'll try and play it across. That's a goal, isn't it? <laughs> the animation by Tembo as well just really puts that cherry on top. I'm going to have to fix up some sliders for legendary difficulty if this keeps going. Because ultimate is definitely crooked. There's something going on. Tembo is flying around the place. He is trying so desperately to get as a result. Eight corners for Doncaster. It's a barrage. Foul on Chad Prince. That's pretty clear and he doesn't even get a yellow card for it. I've never played anything like this and sometimes that's a good statement for games. This is, uh, this is not the case. This is a very bad statement. I have a YouTube channel. I want to entertain people despite not wanting to play this game at all. Wow, wow. F me. I'm directing it over the defender, giving a path to Bobby Monk. And he actually floats it over Bobby Monk. We lose all momentum and lose the ball. That'll be a goal. Roof of the net. I brought out Tembo. I've lost my head. 64% possession. White ball ain't helping, even though that's no excuse. It's three. This is so f cursed. Wow. It's four over Tembo with a lofted head up. Two. <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> oh, Bobby Monk. Here we go. Sampras. Please. <laughs> Jeez! Um, nah, um... <laughs> I'm done. I'm done. It's, uh, I'm, I'm just, uh... Oh, dear. I know that, to a point, this stuff is really entertaining, but it must be getting really, really tiring for you guys now after five episodes of it. The same thing over and over again. Let them score a fifth. I don't give a shit. Full time and the booze ring out. Leighton Orient nil. Doncaster Rovers five. Crew Alexandra against Leighton Orient. Up you go. Nantanine is trying to find Jean Paul Sabali. It's a beautiful pass. Jean Paul Sabali. Stopped by Yaskalainen. Here comes the corner kick. Yes! Courtney Scott. 1 0 Leighton Orient. Getting a run out of Yomba, which at least stretches the play. I won't be giving the ball to him. Jean Paul Sabali. Just happily, let's crew have the possession of the ball. It's them lousy passes that really get us into trouble. Amit Panda was on side, but there's a little flick out by one of the defenders. Oh Big slide tackle. Love that, Amit. <laughs> <laughs> oh, if you don't laugh, you'll cry. Was it the loose touch by Yasin Hassan? Ah, oh, lovely stuff. What an assist. John Paul Sabali's getting manhandled. Nothing doing. The referee turns a blind eye to it all. <laughs> we'll find the back of the net there for 2-1. Everybody expected that turnaround. Remember when we started the season so brightly. I feel like the run that we've been on right now has aged me by a year. Courtney Scott can't intercept. That's 3-1. Defense is all over the place. Centre-backs don't know what they're doing. Combine that with an AI so intent in making you have a bad time. Whoa. You are heading for a rough patch, my friend. That's a great goal by Amit Panda. I'm in a battle against myself because I really want to beat this AI. 
but I don't think I can do. Once I overcome this, I'd be happy to turn the difficulty down. This is not football. This is just straight up cheating. It's like when you're online and you're shooter and someone's using a name bot. Tembo has gone from one of the best goalkeepers we've had to someone absolutely bang average. The defence have gone from something promising to back where we were at the start of the entire series. Can pounce on that loose pass. Panda tipped around the post. Radu Flocka, questionable fashion, must be said. Is this going in? Probably. Just stunning saves. We can only dream of that stuff at the moment. Ah, yeah, there's another one. We'll have the sixth there for Alexandra. Absolutely putting us to the sword. 7-2. If I turn down this difficulty, I won't be happy with the wins. I need to beat this. 14 shots to 8. They scored, what, 1 in every 2. We only scored 1 in every 4. We're living on different levels here. I just need to bring it together for one game and then we can get out of this hellhole. Sliding down the table, 13th place at Crington Stanley is the last match of the year. I mean, what a time to change fortunes, put everything into this. We haven't seen Bobby Monk for ages and that's just weird. Proctor's too far back. And the reaction times. The reaction times are ludicrous. Proctor could have easily stopped that. And he was like, you know what? I'll think about it. I might intercept it next Tuesday. <laughs> what have I done now? What have I done now? What is that? I just rolled it out for my guys. Bro, bro. What is going on? Bit of speed by Amit Pandor. He should have the beating of these defenders. 1-1. One, one. We've got 10 minutes to score a goal and get out of this mess. Sam Lewis has been a rock today. And now we have options. Sampras, win it for us. Be full time. 1-1. One, one. I don't know if Radu Flocker's got a few words for that match. I definitely have. It's all a fix. Scenario. Jean-Paul Sabali has taken to open water swimming. The only problem is that he can't swim. The club feels like the sensible thing to do is to make a sizable donation to the lifeguards. One million pounds has been taken out of our transfer budget. Well, this has been Cutsy. Thank you ever so much for watching this episode of Youth Squad Legends. I'm trying my best to get a win at the moment. Youth Squad Legends is nightmarish. But still, try and support the series as much as you possibly can. I know that things will turn. We will win against this AI. I won't let it go. And then it's onwards and upwards from there. If you've enjoyed this video, then please give it a like. If you're not subscribed around here yet, then press the red box down below and the bell icon for mobile notifications. Big thanks to everybody on the right hand side supporting me on Patreon. I will see you next time. Thank you very much. Bye bye.